Hey guys, for Dr. Sal, we want to go ahead and talk about how we roll some of the parts of our body. Today we're going to talk about our calf. Okay, so most of you got a softball at home, you can use a lacrosse ball, or if you have a foam roller, you can go ahead and use that. When we're attacking the calf, a lot of us have this motion where our toes turn out whenever we squat. If that tends to happen, we want to focus more on the outside portion of that calf. Okay, so the way we're going to do that is instead of sitting immediately on the calf, so we want to get right in the meat, okay? You can place this other foot over. We go ahead and do that, and we try to find those tender spots, okay? Wherever you feel that slight pain and it starts to get really tender, you want to sit on that spot till you feel a release, meaning that knot kind of goes down and it doesn't feel the same, okay? This is rolling the deep portion of your soleus and also the middle and lateral gastroc, which is your makes up your calf, it's what gives it that shape. Now if we want to tack the outside, all we would do is get closer to this outside portion and we want to attack right here. You have your shin bone, we want to get to the side of it and for me myself I've got some tension in there right there and we want to do the same thing. We want to drive down into that ball, find those tension points and then we can turn some more and even get closer to that shin bone and work those peroneals, okay? Whenever we're rolling, we wanna be sure that we're doing it until we feel a release, okay? So that's gonna feel like almost like tension leaving the body. And we wanna sit on those, those